Welcome to the Google Meet tutorial. First, once you're in Google, click on the Apps Launcher. Scroll down until you see Google Meet. Click on the green button that says Join or Start Meeting. Now you need to name your meeting and I'm going to name mine Science Lesson. And then I'm going to click Continue. Now Google is going to set your meeting up for you. It's going to check to make sure you have a microphone and a camera. There I am. And now I'm going to click the green button that says Join Now. If you are expecting your students to join this meeting with you, you can send them the link through Google Classroom or send them the phone number so that way they can hear you. However, this meeting will be recorded. You can also add people down at the bottom by clicking and adding their email addresses. Alright, so I'm in the meeting now and I'm going to scroll over to the three dots and I'm going to start recording this meeting. This is a new feature that we will have through July the 1st. It's going to ask my permission to record. I say yes. And now it's recording. Look up in the top left. You're going to see the record button going and that means that my meeting is being recorded. Down in the lower right, I'm going to turn on the captions. This is a great feature. Google is actually going to type out everything that I say. I can also turn it right back off. It will not type out curse words though. You don't need to try it. I want to click on the present now button and I can present part of my screen or my entire screen. I'm going to choose a window. This is an iMovie that I've been working on, and now everyone who's in the meeting is going to see what is on my screen inside of that window. When I click the Stop Sharing button, it's going to bring me back to my camera, and there I am again. I click on those three dots again, you'll notice that there are some settings in here. I can choose to use the camera that's on my computer or I can add an external camera and the same with the microphone. I also have the ability to turn off my camera in the tray down below. Click on the camera and now they'll just see my little icon that I have for Google. I click it again, there I am. I can do the same thing with the microphone. Up in the top you'll notice a little bubble. This is a chat feature. This is great if I do have kids in my meeting with me. They can actually ask questions or send comments. Just be careful because there's no moderation with that. I think I'm going to turn this recording off now, so I'm going to stop it. And what's really cool about the recording is it's going to go to my Google Drive. And I'm going to go ahead and end the meeting, so I click the red phone and now the meeting is over. I do have to wait about 10 minutes before I will see my recording in my Google Drive, but if I scroll down through my folders, yes, I have a lot of folders, there's Meet Recordings. When I click inside, there's the meeting I just finished recording. I can choose to share it out with particular people, or I can send it out as a link. I use anyone can view with a link. I'm going to click save and copy that link and I can put that link in Google Classroom. If I'm not sure where my recording ended up, it's really cool because Google will email you and you will know exactly where your recording is. Remember, we only have the recording feature until July 1st. Thank you for watching.